know that you're a phoenix, so rise up from all those ashes today. Yeah, you were scarred, but you a czar. You can crawl to the grave. I know you know that a lion's inside, sleeping in your heart. Step back and remember who you are. What up, Pride? It's your boy Mari back again with another reaction video. Today, we are getting into a song called Why by Stray Kids. I was told that this is an OST of some kind for what? I am not sure, but that is what we're getting into today. I am excited. I have really enjoyed Stray Kids music. I've been diving into their music more recently, and it's just all been bangers. It's been nothing but fire. So. I'm expecting this to be great as well. Hopefully you guys are having a great day. If you're new here, definitely make sure to like, comment, subscribe, and share not to miss any more content like this. Like I said, I have more Stray Kids videos on the channel and on Patreon, and more are coming in the future. So definitely make sure to subscribe, not to miss any more of that. It's free, it don't hurt you none. So go ahead, hit that subscribe button. But without further ado, we're gonna get into this, and I'll see all of you guys on the other side. What is your problem? I ain't got time for the chitter to get. I could not know who I was. I'm at some water. I said, I guess I get. They all think the same, but why can't they understand us? When? Every day, every night, they cannot stop with the blah blah. When? They're everywhere, everywhere, looking like stopping hyenas. What did they want? How am I gonna survive? We feel the same actions, but we are the victims. Okay, so this is. Yeah, yeah, uh-huh, yeah, okay, um, Stray Kids, uh, this is them in their, like, EDM bag is, ah, wow, that was, that was a very interesting, uh, intro with the brass stab into the, uh, super distorted synth, they have, like, some effect on the entire composition, like, the, the production half of the song, that is like really uh interest it's, it's kind of like it's distorted and fuzzy but it's also like a little like metallic i i guess is the best way to uh describe it i don't know it's interesting though it, it definitely gives the song like a distinct color a distinct vibe a distinct feel you know uh, and I really like the Forts of the Floor, which Forts of the Floor is a kick on every downbeat, so that doom, 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 doom. Uh, very easy to to dance to, uh, to, to march to, to get hyped to. It's just like a very energetic uh, vibe. And then on top of that, or I guess paired with that, they have like this uh, like drum roll situation that's happening to kind of like fill in all of the off beats. And uh, that makes the song more interesting. Uh, rhythmically and percussively uh and then something happened where there was like a, a space melodically and then we went into like this like bell synth thing that i probably made a really dumb face <laughs> during uh because that that caught me like way off it's stray kids like i can never be prepared coming into their songs because they be having like eight songs in eight seconds and it's always like something like production wise or musically very interesting um i just ah, yeah that was just it was just like it's just an interesting start to the song um but yeah so far this is like this is like i don't know i can't think of a song off the top of my head right now but you know what i'm talking about like they have different songs that are while well, all of their songs are like genre bending and and multi-layered as far as genre goes they have songs that are like more edm heavy and this is one of those songs so um curious what what like thing this is is like an ost for i could see this being like an a really dope anime ost but like a shonen anime or like some type of like battle sci-fi like fighting anime because this is like not that this makes me want to fight people not that it doesn't but um yeah it's just like energetic you know uh and watch this like end up being like like some k-drama or something where like the, the girl is dating the the rich ceo's son or something you know what i'm talking about something that's not at all like what i'm picturing but um yeah this is this this is yeah this is cool <laughs> where everywhere looking like stopping hyenas what did they want how am i gonna survive we could the same actions but we are the victims Mama, 
Okay, so I think that was the chorus. It felt chorusy. I think they said why in there at some point. I was more like jamming than like really analyzing the lyrics. Felix said something about hyenas at one point or something. I don't know, but but that felt chorusy. Okay, uh, I liked it. I, I really liked the whoa oh 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 ohs in the background. You know, you know what I'm talking about. I'm not singing it right now. I don't know the notes, but you know what I'm saying. Uh, that was really cool. That it felt like almost like fan chanty like i could see stay just like collectively like like singing along to that as they're performing this i don't know if they're going to perform this it's an ost it's not like on an official project i don't think so might get like lost in the cracks they have like a billion in one songs and only so much time to to perform them so um i don't know but if they did perform this i could see that being like a a collective like Thing, you know like just like a vibe that everybody's just like on uh which is super dope also soon mean hit like some great woo 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 note there that needs to be said that was fire i was i was elevated okay it just it just caught me i again probably made a, a dumb face i'm probably making a lot of dumb faces during this song but um they they're just doing they're just doing stuff Great expert analysis there, my guy. But yeah, that's that's really the the best way to explain it. They're just they just doing stuff that's hitting your boy right here, okay, right right here. And um, yeah, I I like this. I like that. This is like very different from well, basically the, the Stray Kids songs I was playing earlier. But um, I I like it if that makes sense. It's it's a very I don't know I don't know if I can compare this to any of their other songs that i've reacted to mind you i have not even scratched the surface of the iceberg of their catalog but um this song feels kind of different i don't know kind of unique Okay, real quick, I just, I just wanted to say it before we, we got too far from it and then it didn't make sense for me to comment on it, but I didn't want to stop as soon as it happened because it happened like right after I unpaused and then it was like, it's too soon to stop again, but it, it needs to be said. I feel like Hyun Jin was floating on this song, bro. Like he was really, he was, he was in a pocket, you feel me? Like a Zippo lighter. I mean, I'm just saying, like my boy was, he was, he was there, okay? You feel me? I just, ah. It was good. I don't know, not one word he said, because I'm, I'm looking at the lyrics, but they're just like, you know, like people be like, it's in one ear and out the other. In this case, it's in one eyeball and out the other. I'm just vibing. I'm not going to lie. I, I really don't know. It's something about noise and, and louder or something happens in the chorus. But um, yeah, if you, were, if you were expecting expert analysis of the lyrics, breaking down all of the, the double and triple entendres, the, the nuanced syntax, and and all of that. That's not that's not this video. Sorry, this is just me hype, bopping. Yeah, I'm jamming. You know, I'm I'm having a good time. Uh, hopefully you are also 
have a good... Do you like this song? Let me know what you guys think about this song in the comment section down below. I feel like this is... I, I, not that Stray Kids has, like, a sound, because, again, their sound is the fact that they, like, mix a bunch of genres together, turn it to 11 on hypeness, and then, like, rap and sing over it, you know? Um, but I say that to say, this... For some reason, this song just feels different to me than a lot of the other Stray Kids songs that I've heard. And so I'm curious to know what you guys think about it. I'm assuming you like the song because you clicked on this video, but like, just let me know. Like, what are your, what are your thoughts on it as far as like some of their other, <laughs> as far as some of their other songs? Um, Cause this is, this is like very, di I feel like this would be hard for me to rank if somebody was like, where do you put this in the hierarchy of Stray Kids catalog? First off, my first response would be, well, I haven't heard enough of their music to like accurately say that, but of the songs that I've heard, it it feels hard for me to, to categorize this with like some of their other songs, you know, because um, it just it feels different. And maybe I'm tripping. Maybe it's just the, like the mood. I mean, I don't know. I I could be like way off base here, but also music is subjective. So I could just claim that all of you guys are wrong. And like my subjective opinion is the only true right one, like most music critics. But um, no, nah, like it, it could just be me. But this this feels unique. And it's vibe, you know, but I really enjoy it. It feels like very like, like up tempo, anthemic, dancey. Um, I don't know what choreography like for this would look like, but I know that like watching them perform it would be really fun. You know, um, I'm saying that this song could be like really like sad or, or like, like angry or something. I don't know, but it just feels, it feels fun to me. You know, like I'm having a good time dancing to it. Okay, that was great. This is too far that way. Anyway, uh, yeah, I, yeah, yeah, I enjoyed it. I don't know why that just felt so different to me, uh, but I really, I really liked the vibe of it. You know, it was very, very energetic, very dancey. The percussion of it was just like so rhythmic, so interesting. Like so many different uh, fills and, and drum rolls, and and um, just a lot of different like breakbeat kind of like weird stuff happening down there on the low end and and it was it was dope um yeah i feel like i feel like i think it's han who was rapping in the chorus leading into sung min's high note uh and then i think coming out of that i don't know it might have been i in or something like that like little section there of like rap into high note into like a little bit more singing that's that's just my favorite part so i'm not gonna lie i'm glad that that's part of the chorus and not like the bridge they tend to like go crazy on the bridge they'd be snapping on the bridge uh but the bridge only happens one time in the song versus this happens like four times in the song so uh yeah i enjoyed that that was great um let me know what you thought about it in the comment section down below uh, if you have any other things that you would like me to react to also leave those in the comment section down below while you're down there definitely make sure to subscribe like i said it's free it don't hurt you none if you've watched this far and you enjoyed all this madness you might as well subscribe because more madness coming down the pipeline on the way just for you so yeah definitely make sure to hit the subscribe button i will be seeing all of you guys here on the channel next time you guys have a great day Sit back, don't stress. Just don't stress. Life is too short for you to drive inside that mess. You stuck along the line, so decompress. Get your skin back, you got no worries.